Hey guys, so it's really overcast and gloomy today, so I'm hoping the lighting isn't too terrible for you, but I am here to plan out my um, personal plans and my Erin Condren. Uh, if you had a chance to check out my other video, I did plan out my um, fitness planner here uh, using a Navy Wife kit called Whimsical Day. Um, I do have quite a few leftovers um, from that kit, so that's why I split them up between the two planners. I've actually got all of the deco. Um, I do have one full box. I've got ombre heart checklist. I've got a couple quarter boxes. I've got pretty much almost all of the washi strips. Uh, I do have some headers, my little, my weekend banner, some bill do. Um, I've got the bottom washi strips. I do have this really cute quote box and some ombre heart checklists as well. So um, I did also grab the rest of the sugar paper um, sheet that I had. It's uh, basically a package that I had purchased at Target for super cheap. It was on clearance. I think it was like a dollar and a half. Uh, I just love the foiling. I think I got about five or six sheets in a pack. So it's a really pretty good deal. So I'm actually thinking I'm, I've got a lot of plans this week. So I'm thinking I might want to use some of this area down here on the bottom. So I'm, what I'm going to do is use this super thin washi instead of like the big fat guy. All right, make sure I actually put it in the correct section. Now what I'm thinking I may also do is bring in like a strip of my own washi just to kind of fill a little bit because I don't think this is even big enough and frankly I'm just too lazy to uh, trim down the fatter stuff. Uh, yeah, I don't know why I've got so many things going on this week or why I'm trying to cram so much into my week, but we'll see if that's actually feasible for me. So, alright. So I've got my washi down. I'm gonna... Hmm... I am going to use my little tiny washi strips here and going to use some of these as headers. Just like pulling in as much color as possible and using up as much of the kit as possible as well. Um, that is why I have decided to um, actually split my kits between the two planners originally. I found I had so much extras and so much waste and I was never using them. So this is a way for me to use up as much as possible for my kit. I love these colors. I never would have expected to put these colors together and love them, but they are super pretty. Again, this is a kit I got, well, quite some time ago actually from Navy Wife Planner. Um, they are matte, so I don't know if that's a deterrent or not for some people, but uh, I like that, that matte's repositional. I do love the feel and the look of glossy, but I tend to make a lot of mistakes, so <laughs> that, that matte speaks to me a little bit more. Although I did recently purchase some undo, so that should help with the, the glossy kits that I have. Alright, now my middle section I always use as a to-do section, so I'm going to lay those down. Now she does have the headers um, in ombre, and what I did in my personal, excuse me, not my personal, this is my personal, in my fitness planner was just randomly put the different colors across in the header section. So that's what I'm going to do with this one too, to kind of make them balance a little bit. I don't know, for some reason I like the cohesiveness as well of having the same kit used in both planners. It just gives me joy. Alright. Laying these down super crooked. And like I said, I'm just kind of randomly throwing these down. There's no real rhyme or reason to this. I feel like I sound super raspy today. I think I'm coming down with something I woke up with a little bit of a sore throat this morning and I don't know if it's just the weather because it doesn't know what it wants to do. One day it is gorgeous and 80 and the next it's rainy and cold. So we'll see if this sore throat kind of goes away. I think I'm gonna try to make a cup of hot tea or something later and hopefully that'll help a bit. Alright, so I think these might be too skinny. Oh, those are definitely too skinny. So, 
Hmm. We'll use the slightly fat ones, and I think we'll be okay. Just kind of put them in the middle. There we go. I think that looks pretty nice. And I'm just trying to match up the washi to the ones I'd or the pattern I'd already used at the top. I think this is the yep, elephants. There we go. So one of my favorite things about Navy Wife is that she's got really fairly unique prints and patterns. I know a lot of times you'll see some of um, the same like clip art in kits and like a bunch of different shops. Granted, there'll be like slight differences in um, like the full boxes and the setup of the kit and stuff, but um, I feel like she's got a lot of really unique stuff. I've never seen anything like a lot of the stuff that she has to offer so I really that this is what originally drew me to her and then I had a quite a stockpile of kits so I haven't purchased from her recently but I will probably do so again in the very near future as I'm actually running a little low on kits it seems I uh, go back and forth between buying a lot of kits or buying a lot of like functional stickers um, and then I'll buy 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 and then I'll be like okay now it's time for kits 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 and then it's back to functional I bounce back and forth a lot depending on what I am looking for so let's see she's got green and purple we're just gonna alternate across and just randomly grab colors because they're kind of um, breed themselves as well I really like this deep purple. It's very pretty. It's odd though. I never, like I said, I never would have thought the green, the yellow, this like maroony purple color. All very pretty. I think that one's a little crooked, but that'll be fine. I'm trying to be a little bit more. Um, laid back in my planning, not being quite so um, particular about things being straight or perfectly lined up and just kind of going a little bit more uh, with the flow of things. I think I'm going to go a little bit darker on that. Um, in the past I used to pick stuff up and put it back down probably a good 10-20 times if it wasn't straight until I got it how I felt I wanted it and it ended up either sometimes ruining the page, ruining the sticker, so just a more of a plunk it down and away I go. Because nobody's perfect. You're going to have mistakes no matter what, no matter how attentive you are. Plus it makes things a little bit more, I don't know, a little bit more real. Alright, now I do like this really cute quote box, so I'm going to throw this on here right away since it was on my sheets. And, oh, that is just too crooked. Alright. <laughs> Darling girl, when all else fails, join the circus. Sometimes I feel like my life is a circus. Alright, so what else have I got going on? I don't have any bills due this week. So I don't have to worry about that. I'm just going to leave a little blank space up at the top to fill in my work schedule. Um, let's see. Do I have any big events? Nothing that I can think of. I did end up... Let's see, having to change some of my wallflowers out. And I'm going to use one of these gold foil labels for that. I swear, all my wallflowers, my um, air fresheners seem to either go all at different times or all at once. I ended up changing like four of them yesterday. Today's Tuesday, by the way, in okay. case. So, Monday's already done. I already know what I did for that day, but... Um, you know what I did forget to do? What I'm going to do with this full box? Hmm. I'm not sure yet. We'll think about that. Alright, so what did I do on Monday? So I had work. I changed up my wallflowers. I was just going to put that up there. 
and I did some meal prep, so I'll fill that in. Oh, but you know what? I think I've got an icon for that. Got tons of icons, actually. Um, and, ooh, this yellow one will be really pretty. I've got these Libby & Co. Uh, crock pots. I kind of use those usually for um, indicating meal prep. Um, so I'm just going to sort of stick this at the bottom. And then, I think... Well, I've got a couple more checklists than I'm used to. Let's see, what did I do? Meal prepped two items. I did water my plant, so that's that. So I do have one extra space here. Did I have any other to-dos that I did that day? I'm not thinking so. All right, well, I did watch a little bit of Netflix um, before I went to bed last night. Uh, and I actually happen to have an extra icon. Um, I do believe that's from... Scribble prints go. Uh, it was just a leftover that I had. So, a little marquee. I'm going to stick that down. Alright, what else did I do last night? Ooh, I did a face mask. So, let's grab a label. Or not a label, a little. And I think I'm just going to cover up the icon for that one. And I think I want to pull in some of this peachy color, really pretty. For that. And actually, I'm going to go up here with that. And then I did also paint my nails. We're going to do yellow for that. So, face mask, I do have these Libby & Co. really cute um, face mask girl stickers. Just going to cover up the little icon like that. And I've got some Crest Press nail polishes. Kristen actually got these for me, and I am in love with them. I love the feel of the paper, and I love the little polka dotted bow on them. I just think the detailing is adorable. Yeah, hmm. Should I do the lighter yellow so it stands out a little bit? I think so. I'm gonna do this lighter one. For painting my nails. I'm gonna move that down just a tiny little bit. There we go. Alright. So, Netflix. Painted my nails, did a face mask, meal prepped. Okay, so I pretty much got the layout for Monday done. Um, today, I was actually planning on going grocery shopping. I need to go for a while now, and I haven't made it to the store yet. So today is definitely the day. I've got some other meal prep stuff I need to do, so I want to get that done. Um, so I'm gonna put this. This actually is from Lily Henry. They're a little bigger than I care for, but uh, they still get the job done. So let me just kind of tuck that in. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna move that to the bottom. That way I still have a lot of room because I think I'm only gonna use one line for grocery shopping. All right, nope, scoot that over just a touch. Still not in the right spot for me. See, this is what I mean. I'm trying to be a little bit more laid back because otherwise I would pick up the sticker and put it back down probably five or six more times as I'm now doing that. And I ripped my page a little tiny bit. Oh well. All right, so I do plan on grocery shopping um, today, later today. Um, I do also have to, <clears throat> excuse me, um, wash some dishes as well as, uh some meal prepping. Um, now I'm trying to find those stickers. You know what? We'll skip that until I can find my icons. Alright, so I do have a couple more. Let's see. I did wash my hair this morning. Let's do a green. Now I try to wash my hair every other day or every couple days, just because I know it is better for you. Um, but I have not yet mastered 
going like five days. That there's no way. I don't. I don't think that will ever be something I can do. I know that there's people out there that can do that, and it's just not for me. So if I'm gonna wash it Tuesday, I'll probably wash it then again on Friday. I've got these little teeny tiny bathtub stickers from Mare Bear Crafts. Using these guys to cover the icon on the little label. And I'm running a little low on these, so I will need to order these real soon. I do love them. Alright, so I wash my hair. And then I usually do a hair mask the evening before I wash my hair. So let's do a yellow one. And it's got an asterisk on it, so because I don't really have um, a good icon right now for something like that. So I try to use something that's pretty basic or generic so I don't have to cover that up. Because I'm not really sure. I've got hair dryers, which you'll see later because I do have a hair appointment on Saturday morning. Um, but they're huge. They're real big. So I do need to invest in a little bit of a smaller size. Alright, so I will probably face mask a couple more times this week as well. Let's see. Let's do one on... I'm trying to use the same color so they coordinate a little bit. We'll probably do one Saturday nights. And do one Wednesday. That way I get a couple in a week. I try to do two or three at least a week. And then again, I've got these Libby & Co. face mask girls. I've got tons of these guys left, even though I use them, like I said, two to three times a, a week. Because you get so many when you order from her. She, there's just tons in a sheet, which is really great. And I like that they're vinyl. The only downside is you do have to, if you have any of her vinyl stickers, you do have to write using like a permanent marker because I found my ink joy just smears no matter what. Alright, so we've got face masks, hair wash, um, hair mask, painting nails. I usually only do that once a week. If I've got like a special event or something on the weekend, I'll do that a second time, but that's probably about it. Um, they get super beat up at from work, so they don't last very long anyways. Alright. Oh, I did have oh, these computers, which I've been trying to use up, um, because they, again, they are quite large. So, um, let's see, today's Tuesday and I'm filming. The green doesn't quite match, but the yellow doesn't look bad. Or should we do the purple? I never seem to use much in the way of purple. Even the, pur the purples, no. Hmm. Nope, we're gonna do purple. Or that one. I could pull the orange. Let's do. Keep changing my mind. I'm sorry, guys. I'm indecisive. Super indecisive. Okay, so today we're filming and editing, and then tomorrow I will upload and then Saturday I'm probably going to film my um, fitness plan with me for the following week and then I will edit and upload on Sunday All right. that guy's a little on the crooked side so we'll get him ooh and I bent my page real bad Oh, I'm just a klutz. Klutz, klutz, klutz. Oh, well. Alright. So I don't need my face mask. I don't need my grocery shopping. Let's see. What else do I have? I don't have any bills due. Could have used these washi strips with headers. Just now realizing that. Um, would be... Ooh, I did. Let's see. I do plan on reading this evening. Let's use a purple one for that, I think. I've just started. Well, it's not a new book because I have read it in the past, but I'm I'm rereading like the Sookie Snack House series. And right now 
I am reading Definitely Dead. I think it's like the fifth or sixth book in the series. I do have quite a ways to go. So there's like 12 or 13 of them. Um, just trying to get through them because I have not finished the whole series. I do own the entire series, but I've never gotten around to it all. Um, if I read later in the week, which I'm sure I will, I'll probably put another one down. And I do have some more littles to, to do that with. Um, let's see, I will be grocery shopping. Oh, I do, I want to make my mini frittatas. I make these really yummy. mini frittatas in my muffin tins. Basically just throw in a bunch of ingredients and then I'm going to skip the icon. Um, I use egg whites and then I just pour it over the ingredients and then I bake them in the oven. Super yummy. They're even good cold which is kind of nice because then you don't have to worry about heating them up in the morning. Can you just kind of take them and go? Alright, so this little bottom section I wanted to use as outfit of the day prompts. I found a couple that I really liked, um, and I want to start being more conscious of um, making an effort of <clears throat> taking the time to really, you know, plan out my outfits, accessorize, um, try to basically look a little more put together. So I'm going to use these camera icons I got from the Planner Junkie. I love the vintage look of these. There's a couple of them that the colors go kind of well. So I'm just gonna put these out and I'll fill in the prompts later. Just kind of alternating. I've, I've used these quite often, um, but they are sometimes hard to find um, kits that they go with because there are multicolors and a few of them and they have a very specific feel to them because they're all like the vintage cameras. Right. Oh, how could I forget Coffee Friday? Man, I almost forgot the best day of the week. How dare I? Alright, so leaving that little bit of room at the top for my work schedule and just going to try to adjust this a slight bit. And I think I laid it down exactly where I had it the first time. Oh well. <laughs> Again, trying to be a little bit more laid back in my planning. And I've got these um, coffee icon stickers from Planner Bliss. And I think this yellow one will go quite nicely. It's also payday that day. And I think I had some payday icons that came with the kit itself. Um, if not, I did grab some payday icons as well. But yeah, payday is here. Um, hmm. Let's try to make that a little bit more fun. I think I'm going to grab one of these foiled flags. I'm going to put it about here, I think. And then go like that. Alright, I don't have any planned Happy Mail this week. Um, I do, however, have Trash Day. Can't forget that. Uh, she's got this little trash can icon, and I think I'm gonna try to put it in between Thursday and Friday because Friday is when they pick up the garbage, and they do it really early in the morning. And I don't know about you, but I try not to get up any earlier than absolutely necessary. So I sort of put it in between Thursday and Friday. Because I try to take it out Thursday night. But on the off chance I forget. I've always got Friday morning. Alright. I've got these little hearts. I think I'm going to add a few of them. Just up at the top here, kind of randomly. I don't know, I think they're pretty. Gives the kid a little something extra. Alright. 
Now again, I don't have any bills due. I don't have any happy mail. I've got my filming schedule in, my payday, my coffee Friday. I did change my wallflowers. I've got all my to-dos, at least as far as they're planned out. Um, oh, I do need to get gas, so that's going to be something. I, I like to keep track of it. I'm not really sure why necessarily, but um, I like to see how long a, a tank of gas actually lasts me. Um, so I'm going to grab another one of these flags. And I will have to get that before I go to work. Just gonna... So there should be... Yep. Uh, Libby and Co. I've got tons of her icons. Um, let's do purple. Purple happens to actually be one of my favorite colors, but for some reason, I think those are the least used color in almost all of my icons. Oh, my hair appointment. Okay, so Saturday morning I do have a hair appointment. And I've got, these are oh, Lily Henry. Um, I wrote it on the back so I wouldn't forget. And I think this orange and purple one will go really nicely. Um, see what I mean? They are huge. Uh, but they will work for what I'm using them for. I've, I don't go to the salon all that often. So it's not the end of the world. But let's put this then like that. And then I just have my appointment. I'll write that in or I might even write a little bit over the sticker. All right. And then it is laundry Sunday. See, again, purple is like my least commonly used icon, which is really weird since it is my favorite color. All right. Every Sunday, change out my sheets, wash all my bedding. So I always put an icon down for that so I don't forget. <sighs> and I do have to wash laundry one other day throughout the week if I'm going to make it the whole week um, to the gym because I need my workout clothes. Alright. Do you have more Lily Henry? Let's see. I'm gonna use the purple. Um, I use the little hangers to indicate putting it away because sometimes I just wash it and then it sits in a basket for a couple days. So I am going to make a concerted effort to actually put that away. I did have somewhere I had washers and dryers but I must have misplaced them. You know, let me just grab those quick. Sorry guys. Um, washers and dryers. You know you've got a lot of icons when you have to flip through multiple pages, multiple, multiple pages to find what it is that you're looking for. As I've got Tons and tons and tons. This whole thing is just full of icons. And each um, pocket's got like three, four, five sheets in each one. Oh, here, my laundry ones, because I don't have enough of them. I've got from multiple shops. Let's see here. I've got Crest Press, I've got Frank Hearts You, Libby and Co. Oh, actually, those dishes don't belong in there. Not sure what they're doing in there. Planner Bliss, Lily Henry, and then more Lily Henry. I think we're going to use Planner Bliss. Alright, so... I think this gold one will be kind of pretty. A little sort of... Put it at an angle like that. There we go. Okay. Do, do, do. All right. I am going to go ahead and take some time. You know what? Never mind. I'm not going to take some time. I completely forgot my sidebar. So I'm going to want to take care of that as well. And I forgot to grab the stuff for that. So I'm actually going to, I am going to take a second. <laughs> I'm going to fill this in and I'm going to grab the stuff for my sidebar and probably fill that in quick. So I will be right back. 
All right, so I went ahead and filled in everything I could. Um, I did finish my sidebar as well as adding, oops, the little bit of deco that I had. Um, so I just wanted to go over the little bit of extras I do have. Um, I've got a couple items of deco. I do have a few washi strips. Um, I've got a couple labels, a couple littles. Um, I do have the wider washi strip, um, a couple ombre checklists. Uh, one full box yet and a few of the quarter boxes now usually have plans that come out throughout the week so I may use a few more of these items but uh, I think this is a pretty good example or um, it's pretty accurate as far as what my plans are for the week um, I do have some extra deco so I might help fill it in in empty spaces but I do like to leave a little room in case stuff does come up um, but yeah if you guys liked it, definitely give it a thumbs up. Um, subscribe so you don't miss out on any of our other videos. If you guys have questions, comments, feel free to leave them below. Thanks guys, bye.